Shifting our focus now, just two weeks to go for German elections. Angela Merkel will be stepping down as German Chancellor nearly after 16 years. And two main candidates for the top post have engaged in a ferocious television debate. Candidate from Angela Merkel's party, CDU Armin Laschet, sparred with his SPD centre-left front-runner Olaf Scholz, who is also the current finance minister. Conservative candidate lashed out at Social Democrat, pressing him on his record on tackling money laundering. He in turn gave a strong rebuttal to Scholz, denied that his office was being directly investigated by prosecutors. It's a miracle how even in this case, when a prosecutor's office comes to your ministry and investigates, you can display such whitewashing. So I'll tell you, if my finance minister were to work the way you do, we would have a serious problem. You see how things are being misrepresented a bit, also by being deliberately twisted. Mr. Lachette, you have to take the blame for that very clearly. There was no investigation at the Federal Ministry of Finance. It is not the case that the Public Prosecutor's Office from Osnaburek has any questions in an investigation against this ministry or against the Ministry of Justice. You created this false impression on purpose. Now the heated debate was followed by a discussion on the future course of action which will also include what alliances and coalitions will be formed. Denn auf keinen Fall mit der Linken koalieren, wir werden auf keinen Fall mit der AFD koalieren, wir werden mit denen nicht mal reden, wir werden nicht kooperieren und Demokraten untereinander müssen nach der Wahl reden und wir kämpfen um Platz 1. However, experts think a three-way coalition is most likely the outcome of the election, a scenario that could take several months to negotiate, during which time Merkel remains the Chancellor. Now, Snap poll suggested that hardball tactics by conservatives had failed 41% of the respondents to judge, judge Scholz, the winner, with just 27 favouring Lachelle. Now, results of the Snap poll further boost SPD's candidate Scholz's chance of replacing Merkel in about two weeks' time. Amin Lache faces multiple challenges. He is witnessing nosedive in ratings as the conservatives are missing the pulling power of Merkel. Remember, she will not be running again after four election victories and 16 years leading Europe's biggest economy. The leader of Germany's most popular state, Nordrhein Westphalia, was also caught in a damaging gaffe. He was caught on camera laughing during a visit to a town hit by lethal floods in July. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.